The sister of 15-year-old Jason Negron speaking publicly for the first time tonight about a legal settlement in the police-involved shooting of her brother. Our Frank Recchia has this exclusive report. There's still a, a massive emptiness within my heart. With every step she's taken over the past five years, 24-year-old Jasmine Melendez of Bridgeport has become the public face of a cause that's very close to her heart, seeking what she calls justice for Jason in the police-involved shooting death of her 15-year-old brother, Jason Negron, in 2017. Today, Melendez speaking publicly for the first time about a settlement she says her family has reached in a lawsuit against the Bridgeport Police Department, the city, and police officer James Boulay, who fired the deadly shots. I do say that I support the decision that Jason's parents and the attorneys reached to end the legal aspect um, of the fight. But Melendez, saying she was not a party to the lawsuit and is not an heir to the estate of her brother, telling us her battle will continue in a very public way. Fighting for justice for his life, fighting for systemic change in the city of Bridgeport, that's gonna continue. Negron, who was not armed and police say was in a stolen car, was shot multiple times by Boulay following a pursuit on Fairfield Avenue. His family's lawsuit says James Boulay's conduct was unreasonable, unlawful, and the result of a policy and custom in the city of Bridgeport where inadequately trained officers recklessly escalate traffic stops and use excessive force that endangers lives without discipline from the department. Melendez not commenting on the dollar value of the settlement. Our family is not going to be silenced when it comes to still demanding that James Boulay is fired and decertified. Melendez, who's headed up a cause that's been punctuated by multiple protests as well as an encampment in front of the Bridgeport Police Department, saying she's sorry she cannot say more at the moment. But in the near future, Justice for Jason wants to release an official statement and go in depth a little bit further at that point. In Bridgeport, Frank Recchia, News 12, Connecticut. An investigation cleared the officer of any wrongdoing. The city declined to comment.